I used to wear the hijab all the time. Alhamdulillah. Now, alhamdulillah, but the thing is, I work in a high school, I don't wear it anymore. And Why? Then, it's just that, I don't know, I'm so overwhelmed trying to wear it. And I hate myself for that, frankly speaking. I always question myself, like, why am I not wearing it? Is it because of the other people I'm working with? Or is it just the environment? Where am I stuck? Quit your job. And I mean it. If my job is going to take me from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it doesn't worth it. As I always say this to myself, don't sell your akhirah for your dunya. It's a lost stock market. Quit if you cannot be you who you are, who you want to be, who you are actually. In wor at work, quit the job. You have awe of Allah, He will give you not a job in high school, He will give you even better. One option. Or you go tomorrow and wear it on Monday. Before you leave, Ya Qawi Qawini. You are the strong, keep me strong. No other options. There is no tomorrow I will do it. Because tomorrow shaitan is going to come to you. Doesn't worth it, ladies and gentlemen, and brothers and sisters. Doesn't worth it. Wallahi ladhi la ilaha illahu. Al-aqil, the wise person. Man taraka dunya qabla an tatrukah. Who leaves dunya before dunya leaves him or her. Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. Here you can see a sister asked, she doesn't want to wear hijab and she used to wear it before but nowadays because of some circumstances or because of she even doesn't know what had happened she doesn't want to wear the hijab anymore and she was given the advice that leave your job if it is the reason for you to leave your hijab my sisters you are a gem you are a diamond you are so powerful and you are so beloved Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves you you are someone's wife or someone's mother or someone's sister so follow the rules and regulations which is given by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Allah will bring peace harmony in your life this dunya this world is temporary just because of the joy of this world don't destroy your ahira Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, Ya ayyuhan nabiyyu kulli azwajika wa banatika wa nisa'il mu'mineen yudnina alayhinna min jalabibihinna thalika adna an yu'rafna fala yu'zayin wa kana allahu gafuran rahima O Prophet, Tell your wives and your daughters and the women of the believers to bring down over themselves part of their outer garments that is more suitable that they will be known and not be abused and ever is Allah forgiving and merciful. This is the 59th verse of Surah Al-Ahzab. My sister Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala clearly mentioned about wearing your hijab and covering your body so listen to what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala advised in the Quran and listen to what Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam suggested and follow how the wives of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam led their life Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will bring happiness in your life Allah will open the doors of risk in your family Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give barakah in your family. May Allah give us the understanding and may Allah make us from those who loves Islam and who follow Islam and who are the beloved slaves of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Please support our Dawah works at www.supportdawah.com.